Hey guys, Chris here from The Sweat Box. I am so excited for our workout today. You guys know our job is to bring you a unique workout every weekday, and we are gonna make sure that we work every muscle group. Your job is to make sure that you schedule those workouts in your calendar. We want you to be accountable, right? So when you schedule them in your calendar, you are going to be 100% committed to your workouts. That's what we need from you. Today, I am bringing you a full Tabata. That means we've got eight rounds of 20 seconds on and 10 seconds off. I've got six exercises for you guys today. It's gonna go crazy fast. I think you're gonna like this. Are you ready to get started? I'm gonna share what we're doing. We're gonna do our warm up and we're gonna just hit the ground running. All right, so exercise number one, we're going into plyo lunges. So if you can't jump, I'll give you a modification for a step back lunge. Second exercise, we are going into a push up, shoulder tap. So one push up, one shoulder tap. Then we're gonna alternate push up and shoulder tap on the other side. Exercise number three, we're staying down on the floor. We are going into a Spider-Man plank. So that means your knee is coming towards your elbow as you're in that plank position. From there, number four, we gotta get up. We are doing two pulsing to one jump squat. So one, two, and jump. And then we are hitting the ground again. We are doing bear crawls. So we are going to three bear crawls forward and three backwards. Now I'm gonna coach you because on round four, we are going to be going side to side. So we're gonna go four forward, and four back, and then four side to side. And finally, our last exercise, we are going to two crunches, and then two leg lifts. I'm gonna give you guys modifications for those as well. <sighs> warmed up, I'm already warmed up. Okay, let's get moving. We are just gonna start chest openers, swinging those arms back and forth. Bring them down a little bit, and then back up to chest height, and then back down. Focus on your breathing. Move your legs a little bit too. You can walk around a bit while we do this. All right, we're gonna hinge forward, hands on your hips, and we're gonna tuck our pelvises backwards. So, tuck that pelvis forward, and hinge. Tuck that pelvis forward. You can see I'm not arching my back and hinge. Tuck that pelvis forward and hinge. Good job guys. Waking up those hamstrings a little bit. Let's lift our knees up and out. Open those hips up a little bit more. Hope you guys are having a great week so far. All right, let's go inwards. Bring those knees in. This is a quick warm up because trust me, <laughs> we're gonna be warmed up by exercise number one. All right, let's go into jumping jacks. We've got our final 20 seconds here, and then we are gonna get our Tabata started. Again, eight rounds of 20 seconds on and 10 seconds off. I am gonna give you a minute break in between exercises so you can catch your breath, grab some water, Tighten that ponytail up. All right, we're going into plyo lunges, guys. So again, we want to have our shoulders back. We're going to drop that back knee down. We're going to jump up and pause when we're in that lunge position. If you're not jumping, you are going to step back. Are you ready? Okay, we've got 10 seconds to go. Make sure you listen for that beep. All right, we're going to start in that lunge position. Let's get doing this. All right. Use your arms to pull you up. Inhale up. Exhale as you land. Try not to hinge too far forward. Woo. All right, rest. That's one. Okay. Wake those quads up, here we go. Let's do this. 
Drop that knee down as much as you can. You got this. Stay with me. Keep that core tight and rest. I do want to show you from the front, my leg's not coming directly behind me. I'm going a little bit out to the side so that I'm balanced. Here we go. Looking down, you'll fall over. So find a place to look at straight ahead. Okay, are we ready? Set. All right, let's 
let's go again. <sighs> Squeeze those shoulder blades together as you come down. Push back up. Touch that shoulder. I'm going to drop to my knees for a quick second. You'll find if you need to alternate just to keep moving and keep that form on point, I'm okay with that. This is your workout. Remember, you're not doing it for anybody other than you. Let's go. Back down, chest to floor if you can. Touch that shoulder. Inhale, squeeze the shoulder blades. Exhale. If you're on your knees, you're gonna keep those knees at least hip width apart as well. There we go, take a rest. 10 seconds goes quick, I know. Okay, who's ready? Let's do this. Down we go, back up, touch that shoulder. It's gonna be really easy if you don't have a lot of core strength to wanna shift your hips so that you can reach that shoulder. I want you to fight that. Think about slow and steady. It's not about how many reps you do. All right, rest. Okay, roll those shoulders back. Back up into that push-up position. Here we go. Touch that shoulder. If you need to reset and pause in that plank position, go for it, that's totally fine. Exhale up and touch that shoulder. Remember, rest. We want to make sure that we're not tucking our chins underneath. You don't need to see your shoes. Not, not, not for this one. Okay, here we go. Ready? Go. Touch that shoulder. Stay with me. I'm here with you guys. I show up for you every time. All right. Remember, I asked you for 100%. All right, here we go. Let's do this. Keep those hands under your shoulders. Woo! All right. Down and up. Inhale. Exhale. You're probably feeling those triceps right now. You want to make sure that your elbows are not flaring out to the sides. All right, rest. Oh, it's a good one, I know. Feels awesome. All right, here we go. All right, I'm going back up on my feet. Down we go. It's not a race here. Stay strong. All right, rest up. Guess what? That was eight. <laughs> we are on break. All right. We're going into Spider-Man plank next. So just while you're recovering from those awesome push-ups, just watch me. We're gonna stay in a hand plank position. We're gonna bring our knee to our elbow on the outside. So not down. We wanna bring it to the outside. Pause. Back down. And then again, pause. I'm not bringing my toes forward. So I'm staying with my toes tucked and I'm only moving my one leg. Working on obliques here, that's the goal, okay? Catch your breath. I need some water too. Hope you guys are feeling good so far. Okay guys, here we go. We're going into Spider-Man plank. We're gonna do that 10 second count in for you. Hands underneath the shoulders. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. All right, bring that knee to your elbow, hold and pause. Return that foot back. Exhale, hold and pause. Try not to let your toe touch the floor. So bring that knee up. Keep those hands under your shoulders. And we are not pivoting or coming forward on our toes. That's a rest. Oh, all right. That sweat is coming down fierce today, guys. All right, here we go. 
Let's do this. Number two. Set. Reset. Full exhalation as you're bringing that knee up. It's a good way to gauge your pace. Back down. All right, rest. Two down. So we're gonna try and keep that pelvis tucked under a little bit so that we don't lift our butts up high. Here we go, ready? Okay. Keep those booties low. Lots of core here, guys. You got this, stay strong. Almost there. Oh. All right, take a knee. Really important when you're in a plank position not to flop down on your stomach. We want you to always take a knee first. It'll protect your back. Here we go. All right, let's do this. Keep those hands under your shoulders. If you find you're drifting back, do a reset. Make sure they stay under your shoulders. That'll ensure that your butt stays nice and low too. Whoa, yeah, so good. All right, take a knee. Oh, abs are on fire right now. Roll those shoulders back. Let's do that reset. Here we go. Let's do it. Exhale, drive that knee up to the elbow. You got this. Stay focused. Squeeze those obliques every time. Wow. Hope you guys are feeling really good here. Roll those shoulders back. Yeah. Okay. I'm ready. I hope you are too. Here we go. Ugh. Remember to exhale as you're driving your knee up. Okay, you're providing a little bit more room in your chest area so that you can get that knee up. All right, rest. Okay. Even if this is really hard for you, that's okay. It's the only way that we make change, let's go, is when we're challenged. You didn't come here for easy, and I didn't build this workout for it to be easy, but I did make sure that we have modifications for everybody. Slow and steady here. All right, I say it often, you gotta earn that big break. We're not quite there yet, almost. Okay, back up, let's do it. See, I can feel my butt going high, so I just really quickly reset. All right, rest up. You made it through your eight rounds. That's enough of that one, I'd say. Okay, grab some water, catch that breath. You guys are doing amazing. You should be very, very happy and proud of yourself right now. The good news is we're down three. We've got three left. All right, two pulsing to one jump squat. So it looks like this. Toes and knees out, one, two, jump. Land in that squat position. If you're not jumping, one, two, up. Squeeze the quads, glutes and abs. One, two, jump. Even if you wanna do a baby jump, that's okay. So a couple of options for you. Okay, we are ready. We got that 10 second countdown. All right, get that blood flowing the arms and the legs. Here we go. Ready? Let's go. One, two, jump. We want to make sure we're not bouncing. Control that movement. Up. One, two, jump. I'm using my arms. Rest. Good. Okay. I'm going to turn to the side so you can see. I'm sticking my butt back as I'm gonna pulse. 
All right, here we go. Down we go. And then jump. Landing in that squat position. We're letting those knees absorb the shock. If you land like this, you're gonna feel it in every joint. Knees, ankles, hips, and in your back. Rest, two down. Okay. How those quads feeling? Strong, yes? Okay. Let's do this. One, two, back up. Don't forget about your abdominals. We keep those tight the whole time. Breathing, really important. Let's rest. Oh, love it. Okay, here we go. Again, stay in control. That fire in those quads, welcome it. Embrace it. Oh, you got this. Rest. Okay. Shake them out. Stay with me, guys. I'm bringing you the fire today. Let's go. Back. 
All right, here we go. Ready? Tuck those toes. Okay, tabletop position. That's what you're thinking here. One, two, three. You got this. Here we go. Little baby steps. That's what I need from you. Stay in control. All right, well done, everybody. Two down. Okay, here we go. Back in position. Let's do this. Knees up an inch off the floor. One, two, three. Dig those toes into the floor. Baby steps. We don't want those knees coming too far forward. Stay strong, everybody. All right, we've done three. We've got one more. And then on that next one, we go lateral. Here we go. Last one front to back. Let's do this. Two, three. Nice. Stay together if you can. Right here with you guys, sweating along with you. All right. Okay, we're gonna go side to side. So again, start at one side of your mat if you're on a mat. We're gonna go over three, one side, and then back. Here we go, one, two, three. Pause, one, two, three. You got this, one, two, three. Little baby steps, one, two, three. Yes, one, all right, rest up. Okay, I'm gonna turn towards the camera so you can see me now. Here we go. Tuck those toes under. One, two, three. One, hands and feet working together. Three, good, keep those knees close to the floor. Two, pause every time. Three, pause. One, two, three. Pause and reset, good. Well done, guys. Two down. We got two more. I'm gonna start on this side. Are you ready? Let's do this. Here we go. One, two, three. Yes! One, two, three. Stay with me. Hurts so good, guys. We're almost at the end. All right, rest up. We've got one more. Anybody else feeling the sweat coming right from the top of their head? Let's do this. Here we go. One, two, three. Final set of bear crawls here. There's my bear voice coming out. Stay strong. I know those quads are on fire. That's okay. Keep your hands under your shoulders. All right, you made it. Well done, everybody. We are on break. One minute off. Whew. I'm giving you guys a high five on that one. You've earned it. Good thing we're not using our legs because I don't think I can lift mine right now. Okay, we want to keep these workouts engaging and fun for you. We want to make you sweat and we want to have you progress and feel amazing about yourself. Healthy body. Healthy mind and soul. All right, we're gonna flip over. We're gonna do two crunches to two leg lifts. So, you can have your heels to the floor. One, two, two leg lifts. One, two, again, if you've got low back issues, we're not gonna come all the way down to the floor. All right, we're ready for our 10 second count in. Get ready. If you want to kick this up a notch, bring your legs up in the air. Here we go, ready? Let's do this. So one, I'm gonna keep my legs up. Two, back down, leg lift. One, lead with your heels. Two, good. Exhale up, control. You're looking at the ceiling. Rest. All right, one down. Oh, don't go anywhere. 
You look very comfortable where you are right now, I'm sure. Okay, let's do this. Exhale as you're coming up. Two leg lifts. Rest. Well done. Two down. We've got six to go. Stay strong, everybody. Important. Using your abs to pull your body up. Okay, here we go. Two crunches to two leg lifts. Try not to swing your legs. You want to be in control. Using those lower abdominals to help pull those legs up. Rest. Awesome job. I'm going to show you guys with my feet on the floor this time. Again, we're going to dig those heels in, toes up. Here we go. And one, two. Tuck those arms underneath your butt. Protect that back. Stay in control. Rest. Well done. Okay. I'm going to bring my legs up for this one. My knees up. Grapplers position. All right, here we go. Tucking my hands, lifting my legs. Try not to go too fast here. We talk a lot about time under tension. Slow and steady. Rest. Amazing, guys. You should be feeling tired and sweaty, but those endorphins should be kicking in by now. You should start to feel really good. All right, let's go. Thank you to those that already have. All right, grab a leg. 
We're gonna keep that knee facing straight to the floor. If you're finding that you can't keep your balance, put your hand on your belly or find a wall or a chair or a couch or something. All right, we're gonna switch legs. So for those of you that have also set, set your fitness trackers, hopefully you remembered. If you've set your fitness tracker to start the workout, make sure that you don't stop it as soon as we're done. You wanna stop it when we have completed your cool down. All right, let's go to the floor. We're gonna go into pigeon stretch. Bring that one leg forward, back toe goes to the floor. <sighs> Big exhalation as you come down. Push into that bent leg, guys. And switch sides. We are just a quick message away if you need more support and accountability. Both Mark and I are offering uh, virtual and video personal training. And even if you just need a little encouragement, message us on Instagram at thesweatbox.ca. Send us an email, info at thesweatbox.ca. We are here for you. We want you to be part of our amazing community and we want to be able to support you in any way we can. You guys did amazing. You should give yourselves a pat on the back. Give me a high five. Give your partner if you've got one a high five too. I will see you guys next day with another awesome workout. All right, drink lots of water. Be good. We miss you guys.